Hi, this is a tutorial how to remove the ultra base of the Anycubic i3 Mega from the heating bed, the aluminum plate. And I show how easy it is to remove it if you do it in the right way. Okay, the first thing you do is connect your printer to your computer. Okay, then you can use Prontoface to give the commands to the printer. So if you have the drivers installed you can easy connect and set up the temperature is 130 degrees. Voila. <laughs> okay. Set. And after a few minutes you will have this 130 degrees. It's now increasing all the time. Five minutes I think. After wait. And then you can continue remove the ultra base from the heating plate. After the heat bed, temperature went up to around 130 degrees you just use the cutter knife and cut along the edge try to remove the hot temperature of the bed is uh, make the glue a little bit more like uh, liquid then you have to carefully press upward and you will see the bed come up slowly. You can maybe hear it's already goes up. It's lifting off. Slowly but surely. So I need another knife. So I will use this one. Maybe it's work deep inside to lift off. recommend to wear gloves because it's really hot. There it comes. Yeah. So that's it. It's quite smelly now. As you can see, the most of the glue is not on the aluminium plate of the printer, it's still on the glass plate. So it must be easy to clean this off. After the heat bed was cooled down a little bit, I will use acetone to remove the glue from the aluminium plate.
should open the windows, it's quite smelly. This will take some time. The acetone can dissolve the glue and this is the good part of it. This will make it loosen. Look at that. How easy you can remove that. I saw a video on YouTube they use uh, the Italian guy use uh, WD40 uh, and I think it's uh, not so good idea to use it. Just use that spoon. Yeah, look at that. Easy. No problem. Like no end, okay? Yeah. Look at that. Easy to make it clean. Papa. Ich weiß nicht. Very important to heat up the plate here that is loosen the glue. If you not heat it up, it will be very difficult, like with the Italian guy video. Sorry, I don't know his name. Just the corners to go. Almost cold. Try not to bend the plate. Because if it's a little bit bent over, then the glass plate of the new will not fit without problems because there will be a gap between the aluminium heating plate and the uh, glass plate and this will be a problem. So now just remove the sticker and put it on top. Let's go here now a little bit. Oh I love this acetone so much. It's amazing stuff. Everything so easy. Okay, now I will my gloves. Okay, I'm trying here to remove that.
that's it. Finish. Let's remove. And you have a new bag.